Hey guys and welcome to another video presentation and this one is about using the climate panel. So I'm just at a client's house ready to set one up so I thought you know what I'll make a quick video about what I'm doing and how easy it is to create your own climate zones. To start with you log in to the home centre. Once logged in click on the settings tab, click on the climate panel and then as you can see we've got no zones at the moment as we're doing a fresh start here. Click on the add zone button manually then confirm. Then here we've got uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven underfloor heating zones. So what we're going to be doing is creating seven uh, zones of thermostats. So let's start with kitchen and then we're just going to highlight just the kitchen underfloor stat only and we're just going to call it kitchen thermostat click on add now once you've added it it comes up built in with these temperature controls right arrow and then that opens it up to the days of the week and then all we need to do is click on this and then we just adjust temp the timings and we just adjust these timings here to set the temperatures and at these points we can then end up the temperatures so for example um, we'll start the heating off at say 6 a.m. and we'll have it at say 23 degrees then at 11 a.m. we will say drop it a little bit down to maybe 22 and then back at around 6 p.m we'll go back up to 23 and then we'll all the way to around about midnight then we'll just drop it to a nominal 18 degrees and then once we've done that we can then click on either set it up for the working days so it auto will do the working days or we can just do it for the whole week and hit copy and it just does it for the whole week um, once you've done that you just hit save now that it's all saved if I click on there that's the kitchen area done all we then need to do is click on add zones and add all the other zones in there to then create our other thermostats now what happens is it's currently uh, approximately half past 10 here 23 degrees now if I go home go to the kitchen um, there it is and look at that it's changed to 23 degrees so this thermostat will now follow whatever I've set in the climate panel you can override the climate panel by clicking on this button here and it comes up with the thermostat heat mode set and the temperature so we're feeling a little bit cold we can then increase the temperature here say to 25 and also set a time limit on how long we want it to 25 for it's like an override a boost button so let's do 25 degrees for one hour hit set and what that does it's now moved this to 25 degrees it's now set the timer for one hour after one hour it will go back into uh, scheduled mode and you can see by that little icon here that says manual mode 59 minutes remaining and there you are that's 59 minutes and then it will automatically go you can do this from the app as well so you don't have to do it from the computer just by going onto the temperature section of the app. Hope you found that useful. It was just a quick little video while I was here. Um, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.